Ladies and gentlemen, next battle is three rounds on a 72 kg C class tie bout. Stepping into the ring, fighting out of the red corner, representing Warriors Muay Thai is Danny Monville. Making his way to the ring, fighting out of the blue corner, weighing in under 72 kgs, representing Dublin Combat Academy is David McLaughlin. Just making his way. See what each other's offers here. Now switch the stance nicely. Disguises the kick of the hands, but nice left hand. Knocks the head back of McConville slightly there. McConville trying to get different looks to it. You often see how he reacts. Counter left hand was coming straight back, goes high with the kick, McLaughlin this time. Nice right hand in there, body shot, wasn't a lot on it. McConville looks to step in with the knee and pushing forward with a leaping left hook was McLaughlin. It's a clinch right in front of me here in commentary. Nice knee on the inside by McConville, turns his opponent, nice work. Kick was checked and out of range with that kick. Combo's starting to use that step in knee. Nice angle and footwork to get out of the way. Catch the kick and land some good hands, McCombo trying to counter off the walk of McLaughlin. Bell can't be heard there. But you uh, might have been hearing the screams at the time. Seconds out, getting ready for the second round here. Right between David McLaughlin, out of Dublin Combat Academy, and Warriors, Mike Ties, Dan McCampbell, McCampbell again in the black trunks. That was a little low, that shot by McLaughlin. Just waved off by McCampbell, doesn't want to stop the action. Leg kick when McConville steps away. He's really starting to try to use that longer reach that he has and control the distance. He's inside that kick by McLaughlin that time though, and Roy Smile is starting to come across the face of McConville as well. And Danny's starting to have fun in there. Lachlan seems to be stopping in front of McConville now. He doesn't seem to be throwing the shots. He seems to get in range and then not throw, just not pulling the trigger on his shots at the minute. That's more like it. Trying to put pressure on McConville up against the ropes. Changing knees, cleaner work done by McConville on that knee.
seen plenty of low kicks here. I haven't seen much high from both fighters, so potentially they could start the come because they're going to be both expecting low. Looking to step in there. McConnell just needs to be careful. His hands are down a little. That was a nice right hand. That landed square across the chin of McConnell, but wore it well. Nice knees by both men in this exchange. Keep trying to get distance by McLaughlin. Second, and there was just moments in that one where McLaughlin he, he almost got in the position to fire his fights, but he didn't stop. Or he didn't throw, I should say. He just stopped dead. Second out, ready for the third and final round here. The cider collection, pay per view. Look at the back call in action here in Ireland. Trying to walk his way inside that reach to land his shots. Can change it. Kicks here, but the combo is doesn't want to get himself backed up against the ropes and that way he can't utilize that longer range that he has. He needs to stay out in open field and be able to keep McLaughlin at range more so where he is now. Backed up against him. McLaughlin needs to close here when he gets him in against it and he has done so here right in the corner. It's the Conrad who's landing the knees looks to angle his way out of there but he gets him out of there quite easily to McLaughlin but lands a nice shot against the ropes and looking to loop a right hand as well as McLaughlin a little bit more aggressive here in the third nice right hand there just missed with the knee and response with Convo good body shot as well and a good score nice looping right hand just came over the jab that he just thrown starting to find his range again here is McLaughlin Conville seems a little tired here in the third, but starting to fire back now. Deep breath by the young man from Warriors. McLaughlin trying to put it on him, push that action and push that pace. And that's the end of the battle. We go to your judges' scorecards. And like I said, I'm glad I'm not judging it, but McLaughlin. Certainly stepped it up in the third round there, trying to finish the fight strong. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to your judges' scorecards. Judge number one has scored this bout for McLaughlin. Judge number two has scored this bout for McConville. And judge number three has scored this bout a draw. Therefore, a majority draw. And ladies and gentlemen, we've just had an agreement in the ring. We've got a draw, and they want to fight one more. Love it. We're on the round for our fourth round. No such thing as a draw here at the Cider Collection. It wouldn't be the way with the name, but both fighters agreed instantly. Now both fighters know they gotta push the action. One round, sudden death. Who wants it? Nice hands by McLaughlin McGonville pushing forward with the knees.
shouldn't get a love it. Good shot by Bowman. McCombo pushed him forward, bashes McLaughlin up against the corner. McLaughlin look at the turn, it's knee for knee, strike for strike. They couldn't be separated over three rounds. Will they hear? McCombo putting, pouring the pressure on. Seems to be the one slightly more on the front foot. Good knees, good response. Nice knee again, returned by McLaughlin. Strike for strike bout. Nice body kick caught by McLaughlin. Look at the land. Sorry, Copper and McCumber look at the land of strike. Nice knee. Nice left hand as well. Stiff jab. Knee for knee again. Both fighters starting to get tired. You can see it in that punches they're throwing. Of course, they're getting tired of it during a sudden death round. Nice right hand. Nice knee, though. Big score. Miss, no action. So, dance floor moves there by McLaughlin switching hips and stance. Knee for knee, McConvo. Pushing forward, has the clinch. That's it, that's it, sudden dead round over. We once again go to the judges' scorecards. Have we got a decision this time? Ladies and gentlemen, after sudden dead round, we once again go to your judges' scorecards. Your judges have scored this for your winner. Fighting out of the blue corner. David McLaughlin!